Where'd our ship go? Did we lose it? Oh no. Oh no, there it is. Holy crap. Holy crap. Don't go for it. This is your one and only Firespark81 with your daily dose of video goodness. And welcome back to Subnautica Sundays. When we last left off, we just got the... Well, we were exploring the Aurora. We died. And uh, we got the blueprint for the Seamoth, which is freaking awesome. So in order to craft that, we are going to have to make the mobile vehicle bay. Now I went out and I did a little bit of resource collecting, so we should have the majority of the resources that we need to craft this. May have to go out and grab one or two little things. Let's do some eating first so we can get our food and stuff back up to par. I love these freaking trees. These trees are the best. They just provide so much food and I mean, granted this only gives you what, five food and three H2O, but it's still freaking awesome because look how many fruit are on here and it just continuously produces over and over and over again so you know look we just about refilled our food now we're just gonna go ahead and harvest this up till we are at 100% or close to it on both of those or at least the food I have plenty of water here we'll drink a little water if need be I'm gonna let it go for now because the waters we have are really good let's go through here and finish up these resources that i just got finished collecting off camera because i know we're going to need a ton of titanium so we'll go ahead and craft that up first thing i want to do is build this mobile vehicle bay and what do we need for that we need titanium ingot we need lubricant and we need a power cell so let's go ahead and make the titanium ingot we have eight so we need two more titanium to make that, 9, 10, there we go. Pop on back here and craft that. I know I had one of those probably over there somewhere that I already made previously, but you know, that's fine. We can go ahead and craft a new one up, it, uh, it doesn't make any difference. And then what was the other stuff we needed? Lubricant and a power cell. What do we need for the power cell? That's over here. We need two batteries and some silicon rubber there and there and there is our power cell so then the last part of this uh, puzzle here is the lubricant correct yep lubricant well, at least to build the uh, the mobile vehicle bay anyway grab our lubricant that's a mouthful to say mobile vehicle bay gotta like really enunciate that bad boy okay here we go we're building it are you excited I'm excited I can't wait to get the seam off and there we go okay let's go deploy this bad boy go deploy it right above the base up here and release vehicle bay okay no release 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 why aren't, why aren't we doing it are we struggling there it is Hitting the wrong button. I was struggling. It was user error as usual. Okay, let's climb, climb on. Climb on, there you go. And left mouse button, vehicle, SEMA. So we need one titanium ingot, another power cell, two glass, and some lubricant. Wow, that's extremely cheap. I mean, I'm pretty sure we have most of that already. We're gonna grab another lubricant. We got the glass, and we'll just make another power cell. That's easy enough. I don't wanna use it, I wanna get off of it. Okay, let's head back down here. Actually, let's head back over because I know we're going to need the other creep vine cluster. And I'm pretty sure we have another titanium ingot already there somewhere. So that should give us enough to make. Yeah, we have two of them on us. I need to put that egg somewhere too. I picked that egg up when I was out collecting stuff earlier. Because I want to use the once we get the sea moth, I should be able to hunt down the um. They, it's not the large aquarium anymore. It's the alien containment, I think is what it's called, or containment unit, something like that. Anyway, I I uh, have a idea of where that is. So we're gonna need the glass, and we got the where's the ingot? I know I have an ingot around here someplace. At least I thought I did. We'll drop that off there and drop that off. Oh yeah, it was right there. Oh my god, I'm blind. Okay, so titanium ingot, and then we're gonna need two more batteries. No, I don't want to change the name. I want to open it. 
Man, we're putting a hurting on our batteries. It'll be alright though. And we got a message because we did good. We did good, people, apparently. Okay, silicone rubber. Oh no! Crap! That's not what I wanted to make. I wanted to make lubricant. Alright, hold on. We'll be right back. Okay, now that we're done noobing it up and crafting the wrong things, let's craft the right stuff. Okay, lubricant. Was that everything? Is that oh no, we need to make the power cell. So advanced power cell. Oh, we needed the silicon. Well, we already had a silicon rubber on us, but whatever. Whatever. So we have extra silicon rubber. You can never have enough of that stuff. All right, let's go craft our sea moth. I'm so excited. Are you all excited? I'm excited. I can't wait. Because then we can just keep this with us all the time, and it's going to be super easy to pop in it and get our oxygen back up without having to swim to the top. Like, this is a big step. This is a big step in the progression of this game. Oh, we needed two glass. All right, hold on, hold on. Hold your excitement. And pop on this. Here we go. We're going to craft it. Are you, are, are you ready? Are you, I can't even talk. I'm so excited. Here it goes. Look at the little robots. Go. Go craft it, little robots. Oh, look at it. I'm super excited. Look at it go. Oh, right as the sun sets. That was beautiful. I loved it. Uh, can we... Oh, wait. Right there it was. I want to pick it up. Pick it up. Uh, pick up mobile. Okay, there we go. Got it picked up. Now, is that in our inventory? It's in our inventory. No, I don't want to hold you. I can't see where I'm going. Look at it. It's so good. I love it. Let's enter it. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now we don't have the, what is it, the moon pool or whatever it's called yet, but that's fine. We can just park it right out in front of our base. Oh, it's so good. I love it. I'm super excited. Okay, now that we have that, we can do some really deep exploring now. And one thing I wanted to check is that this thing uses the, the power cells, right? Yeah, right there, power cell. We're at 98%. Let's let's blow a little energy and see if we can pull that out. I want to see if that works in the battery charger or if it needs its own charger. Because I'm not 100% sure yet. And I know, I know, I could just look this stuff up on the wiki. But, you know, if I looked everything up on the wiki, then what fun would it be, you know, to explore and find out for yourself? Okay, we're at 98%. That's, that's good enough for now. I don't want to waste too much just in case I can't charge it and I have to make a bunch of these. I know you can eventually charge them now, or at least I'm pretty sure you can, that it was with the whole battery update thing, but I just want to see... Okay, can we pull pull you out? Uh-oh, what happened? What happened? Oh, here we go. Unload power cell. That's what I want to do. Okay. Now can we bring it in here? Bring it in here. Go to our, our battery charger. We have our power cell. Can I can I drag it over here? Okay, you cannot. So this only charges batteries. So for now, we're gonna have to make the um, power cells when we run out. We'll have to make a new one. Which I mean, that's okay. Cause I know, like I said, I know you can eventually make a power cell charger um, and recharge your power cells so it's not that big of a deal we just have to we'll just have to find it I guess I'll have to go to the wiki and do a little bit of research and um, figure out where that's at but I know that is a thing but for now I mean we can recharge our batteries which is good because I do need to recharge the battery on our stasis gun I went a little stasis happy earlier so let's unload its battery and we're gonna pop it in the charger this thing is so good though. I, I love the fact that uh, we can charge batteries. And then like it's great because we have a bunch of backups here. So I can just pull one out and grab our stasis gun and hit the R key and just bam, reload it right up just like that. And we're all stasis and ready to go. You know, while we're at it, let's go ahead and unload the battery from this as well and get it charged. I love how your hands get stuck. Look at my hands, they're just stuck like that. Like I'm getting ready to ride a bike, I don't even know. Okay, let's throw our battery in there as well. And I keep clicking that part, I don't want to click that part. And then we'll go ahead and pull it back out and reload a fresh battery into it. Sweet. That's awesome. And look, <laughs> your knife just floats in front of your hands. 
<laughs> Let's reset our hands because that bugs me. All you got to do is just come outside and then go back inside and it resets your hands and uh, you're working proper now. We want to toss this mo mobile vehicle bay. I don't know why I have such a hard time saying that there and put that there and there and let's go eat and then we're gonna drink one of those waters and then we're gonna go exploring with the sea moth so excited are you all excited I'm excited okay grab plant you know what else I want to do I want to I want to pull you up melon cuz I mean you're cool and all but you're not as cool as this tree I mean the these are cool too because they, they keep growing and you you can harvest a good bit out of them but the melons like in this bulb can I Hold on, let's hit tab real quick. Let's eat and empty out our inventory. Let's just go ahead and eat it all. It's fine. And then I think, can we can we cut a slice? Yeah, and then you can eat it. Oh man, that's really good for H2O. Look at that. How many slices can I cut off of you? Pretty sturdy. Okay, you know what? I'm not, and I think you can cut the melon. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do? I don't even care. I'm just gonna plant a huge old garden. What? Okay, we need titanium for all this crap. So let's go over here. I got tons of titanium, and there's a ton of salvage out there. So I don't even care. I'm just gonna plant. I want all the foods. I just want all the foods. I'm just gonna line this whole area with different foods. And I know I can do the large, but I don't really like the large because they take up so much space. I like these little ones because they're just like individual and this is easier to manage and I think they look cooler. So, oh my God, I can't believe I just ate that. I think that was our last melon too. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Was that our last melon? Crap. <laughs> well... <laughs> That was our last melon, so hopefully the melon wasn't super awesome. I'll go back to the island later. I think we can get another one from the island. Anyway, because I knew we got to There we go. We'll plant another bulb tree. I wanted to plant another melon, but that's not going to happen. So we'll just plant another bulb tree for now. <laughs> I'm a real noob at this game. Like, I, I know. I hit the wrong keys all the time. It's like I said before, I play so many freaking games that that it just like I, I get confused on on the keys that I'm supposed to be hitting and when I'm supposed to be hitting them. Okay, so we have three trees growing now and we have two of those bulbs. What should we plant? What do these give us? Let's look at their stats. Can we eat? These give us a ton of food. Holy sweet bejesus. Okay, so those are really good for the potatoes are really good for food. These are really good. The bulbs are really good for this right here is really good for water. And these are kind of in the middle. So let's plant, let's plant another potato. Just in case I noob it up again. I really hope I can get another one of those bulbs. And that wasn't like my only chance. Ah. Oh. Cannot believe I did that. <laughs> well, actually, I can believe I did that because I do that kind of stuff all the time. You know what we could do? We have the exterior grow bed now, so we could plant that out there and plant some acid mushrooms so that we can harvest them right from the base. We can do the same thing with the... Um, the, that other plant that we use a lot of so let's see here let's see where we can plant that exterior grow bed that's the interior one exterior is going to cost us two titanium where do I want to plant you can I just plant you any old where any old place nope you have to be someplace specific I can plant you directly on top of here that's cool we're going to make this two tiered mm, well we can deconstruct it later no big deal and we'll plant you there yeah yeah I like that look at that that's cool so let's run over here and get some samples of this seaweed shenanigans creep whatever this vines called y'all know what I'm talking about you know yeah I don't care that I only have 30 seconds It'd be fine 
get a couple little samples. And then we'll head back to the house. We'll pop inside real quick. Pop back out and plant that. And then we're going to go exploring, I promise. Oxygen. Yes, I know. Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. That's full. This is this can plant a good bit of stuff. So let's see here. Let's plant those. Sweet. Look at them. They're so tiny. And there was that wither weed we had in here too. I don't know what that's used for yet. But you know what? I'm going to go ahead and plant some of it. Because... Why not? Can we plant this as well? Let's see. I'm just going to plant all the things. I think those are outside though, so let's go back up here. And nope, can't plant that. We can plant the wither weed though, but we cannot grow the coil or coral. Coral, coral, coral. Yeah, you know, whatever. Coral, you know, whatever. You know what I'm talking about. So let's toss that back in there and let's throw all of this away and then, well not throw it away but throw it in there get out of our inventory and then I'm gonna cut a couple more samples of this and you can harvest a lot off of that look at that BAM BAM fill up that water that is so handy can we just keep harvesting it how much I wonder how much you can harvest off of that it just keeps going it's like the never-ending tree all right let's go let's go exploring Let's see if we can find goodies. Now, I don't know the map very well, but I think I think if we just go out this way, I don't know. Like I, said, I don't know where I'm going. I looked at this later. There's there's sealed doors in there. I need to cut her before I can get to that stuff. So what I'm looking for is the Kush zone. Now, you all can berate me in the comments, and I know you probably will that I don't know where I'm going and I could probably look up a map but I just want to go exploring for now see what we can run across maybe find some cool stuff it's just kind of fun oh you know run into some things and destroy our brand new machine that we made all that good stuff now, I don't I don't have my driver's license in game so or my my C driving license I have my actual driver's license I can't drive a car but I am not certified to drive this thing. I just built it and I'm driving it. So we, we're going to run into some stuff. Oh, look at that. That's so cool. Can we get in there? Can we go in? Should we? Oh, no. Those things shoot at us. I don't want to do that. I know that those shoot at us. Let's not go in there for now. Let's, uh, what is with this frame rate? This is like, and I got the new graphics card installed too. So if you notice a little bit different difference in the graphics of everything cranked up as high as it'll go in this game but that when it's loading this thing's a monster too like it can handle pretty much anything I've thrown at it I was running arc on on super what is it the high settings and some ultra settings and everything but super uh, what is it the super intense ground density because that's you know never good for anything uh, let's see. What is that? What is that? What is that? I feel like that's something to scan. Caution. Passing safe depth. Okay, we're, let's go up just a little higher. Now, it can't handle the depth, but we can. So what we're going to do is we're going to pop out of it, and we're going to see... Can we scan you? Oh, a thermal plant fragment. Yeah, I'm down for that. Can we scan this too? There's pieces all over here. There's also those sand sharks, but I'm not really worried. Yeah, we unlocked the blueprint for it. Awesome. We have the thermal plant now. Uh, I think we need a hot zone, but I, I actually, I think our base is near one of those thermal zones as well. That's pretty much all of it, isn't it? This is all just thermal plant stuff. I'm going to scan it and get all that titanium. And then we'll head back to our Seamoth. So even if we can't go the full depth of where we're at right now, that's fine because we can stay like right above it and just kind of shine our light down there if we need to and look. And just skirt around the edge here. 
that that is that is harsh i cannot believe that frame rate lag you get when you load something in i mean i guess that's to be expected for an early access game all right so i'm gonna go just explore around a little bit uh i'll bring you all back when i find something interesting because i don't want to just waste time because these, vid these videos can only be so long oh no and i spoke too soon get off of our ship get off of our ship this guy just oh no 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 do i have to exit Oh, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap. Oh my god. Can I not hit him? Where'd our ship go? Did we lose it? Oh no. Oh no, there it is. Holy crap. Holy crap. Don't go for it. Don't destroy it. Why can't I hit him? Oh no. This freaking... That's it. That's it. You know what? We just built that. Now I have to build another one. I'm going to I'm going to kill this guy. I don't know how, but he's going to die. He's going to die. That's it. This is what this episode is. 19 health and we're going after this reaper because that sucks. Like I was just getting ready to do some fun exploring and and this guy has to come along and just ruin our fun. He's about to get stasis right in the face. Can you even stasis this guy? You know what? I don't even care. I'm going to stasis him and I'm going to beat him to death with this little tiny knife. Yeah, you can get stasis. Do you like that? Do you like it? Oh, whoa. So even if he stasis, you can die. Keep that in mind. Good thing we didn't have anything serious on us. And oh, we're not dead. We're not dead. What is going on? Oh, it's because we're stasis. We're caught, but we're not dead. This is crazy. Can we get out? Can we get... Nope. <laughs> as soon as we, he unstasis us, we're going to die. Nope. Oh my god. What happened? There it is. There's our death. That's two deaths so far. Did we lose anything good? We didn't lose anything. We still have all of our stuff. And I don't think we had anything serious on us. Oh, that makes me so mad. That makes me so mad. I mean, it didn't take a lot to craft it, and I can craft it again, but... Uh, I don't even... I don't even have words right now. I want to kill that thing. Like, I want it to die. Part of me just wants to go back at it and try to stasis it and, and attack it from the back. I don't even know. Are there any weapons in this game that can kill that thing? D do we have anything that can take it out? <sighs> well, I hate to leave on that note, but it's we're coming up to our wrap-up time here, and... I think that's actually going to call it for this episode. Before I go, I'm going to give a quick shout out to my Patreon supporters. Thank you all so much for all of your awesome support. You all are amazing as well as to all of the fans out there. You are all awesome people and you are the reason I do this. Thank you so much for all of your support. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. If you're shy and you don't like to comment, just hit that thumbs up button and show your support. Until next time, thanks for watching.